Verse 19, now repent of your sins, turn to God so that your sins may be wiped away. Then times of refreshment, oh, this is so good. Then times of refreshment will come from the presence of the Lord and he will again send you Jesus, your appointed Messiah. Peter says repent. He gives them the invitation, repent and your sins will be wiped away. He, he's coming from a place of what he received from Jesus. Jesus gave me the opportunity to repent. And so since I have been given that, I'm gonna give you the same opportunity. Repent All right, guys. and your Please sins will be come. wiped away and then times of refreshment will come. I wanna ask you a question. Do you need refreshment today? Do you need refreshment? Let's just think about that. And if the answer is yes, if the answer is yes, which probably for most of us, it's yes. Here's your first step. You ready, to, ready for the first step? If you need refreshment, the first step is to repent of allowing that very thing that has been robbing you of your refreshment. Because if you are in Christ, you have the Holy Spirit living in you. So times of refreshing is your normal. <laughs> That's who you are. So if I'm not refreshed, then I'm allowing something to take my refreshment because that's what I've received from Jesus is refreshment. So if you are not feeling refreshed, the first thing you need to do, you need to do this right now in your house. If you're watching this in your car, you need to do this right now. God, I repent of partnering with fear. It's been taking my refreshment. God, I repent of partnering with anger. God, I repent of partnering with lust. God, I repent of partnering with doubt. Oh, would you refresh me? <laughs> what the Holy Spirit does when you do that is he always keeps his promises. It says times of refreshment will come. It's coming right now. It's coming right now to you.